In this video, I'm going to show you how I assembled this uh, retractable patio cover that I found on Amazon and how does it look after it's fully assembled. The box itself is about 120 pounds when it gets delivered, so it's not too heavy, but you have to drag it in the house. First thing that you have to do is you have to take it apart, prepare your stuff, and also give yourself plenty of room to work. Unfortunately, I was not smart enough and I kind of like crowded everything together and I made it a little bit more difficult for me to put the patio cover together. Also, another recommendation that I have for you guys is uh, if you are going to assemble this one somewhere on the floor, make sure that it doesn't get scratched, put something under it. The box is big enough to help you, but you might need something else to have on the ground so you don't scratch the material before you put it on. The assembly, actually, it's not that hard. The instructions are pretty clear, but it does take a while. So it took me about three hours to put it all together, mostly because I spent my time making sure that I don't make mistakes in the assembly process. A lot of the parts look the same, but they actually require to be installed in a certain order. I've also done it myself, so this was a single person setup, and that makes it a little bit harder because there was like nobody to hold on things. If you have two people, it's a lot easier. Also in the package, you're gonna get more screws than you need, so don't panic if you're gonna have leftover screws at the end. They were nice enough to give you extra ones in case you drop some on the ground. In my case, I did, and they fell between the rocks and I couldn't find them. So there's a very, very nice touch for the fact that they were able to give me more stuff that I needed. It was a very, very good thing that I had extra screws in the box. I will also strongly recommend to have a drill handy. It's gonna be very, very useful for screwing things around. There's a lot of screws in this package that need to be tightened. An electric drill made a huge difference. And with the installation finishing up, this is how it looks like. I still have work to do around this corner. I have to paint the walls. I have to put some kind of like a patio tiles on the ground. I do have the furniture already, but the corner itself needs a little bit more work. The patio cover was the first step before the sun shows up here in Vegas and is going to be super warm and I need the shade. Also, it's going to be a lot easier to work with the shade when I'm actually going to do the, the patio tiles. After assembly, I was able to move it in this location by myself, but I would recommend to just have four friends all together. You grab each side and you could just move it around very, very easily. It can also be anchored to the ground with bolts. So that would be also a plus if you could anchor it to the ground. It's a little bit windy today outside, but uh, this is pretty nice touch. This little cloth over here is designed so it doesn't let these things fill up with water when it rains, if it rains. And then you have this strap to strap everything together so it doesn't blow in the wind, but it's very easy to pull around. Uh, it's definitely retractable, so pretty, pretty cool idea. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video.